hello my name is Nia Hamuda and welcome to my youtube channel in this tutorial I'm going to be creating this video, um, birthday design for Shisom Obona Shisom Obona is my friend and uh, today is his birthday so this is to celebrate him and tell him a happy birthday all right so let's go right into the tutorial so I'll be removing some stuff here okay I uh, don't want to waste so much time with typing so I'm going to be removing um, I resolve some all right this guy is gonna stay this guy is gonna stay all right and um, the images every other thing can go so I'll take this one out I'll leave this because that's gonna be okay I'll take this out I'll take this out I'll take this out and all these guys can go oh sorry all right um this is going this is going this this okay all right so the info, only information i'm leaving behind is my logo the better text and the color palette the, the color i'm going to use all right so this is it so we're going to kick start the tutorial now all right so the first time we bring in right here is the background so this is the background that we're going to use so i can decide to use this 1.1 ratio okay which is square and um okay should i use this or this okay let me use this okay so this is it all right i don't prefer this one i think i prefer this here all right so this is it all right so just drag it okay let it just fill the screen right here okay all right so this is it so now the next thing i want to do is to get the image all right so let's get the image okay um this one right here all right so just this is the image we're going to be using so i'm just going to crop this out all right all right so this is it so in the first tutorial i allowed the other information to be here so to do that just click on this and click on this no sorry this guy here then pull it here okay so it's gonna be like that okay all right now the next we're gonna do is um let's leave the image first let's work on the background image this background image will be around so it's gonna be here so we can bring this guy no 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 not this one um not this one definitely so this is gonna be the background image all right just crop it like this and bring it here all right so this is it all right i'll bring this to the front and this guy i'm going to fend it a little so I'll reduce opacity like this and i'll go to contrast i'll increase it i will take the brightness down like this all right okay Right, we can still go ahead and reduce the opacity okay this is okay all right so we've fainted the image now inside the background all right so the next thing we want to do let's increase this guy a little all right okay then let's bring in text all right so then the basic text is going to be happy birthday okay so for the happy i'm going to be using i'm going to be using a script font so happy so we're gonna use a script font. So go to font and go to font. Okay, so this is a script font we're gonna be using. Janeta, okay. And then we'll use padding. So anytime you anytime you choose a font, um, especially with Pixel Lab, try to check if the font is really hard properly. So this is Janeta. This is gonna be 
let's use yellow right the next is going to be birthday right so let's go click here and then we'll go over the birthday okay all right so this is it so we're going to be using b-bands so use b-bands for it okay so this is it then we can go ahead and let's let's increase this guy All right. so we can go ahead and bring in the text the better text okay which is this right here uh, yes and then bring it to the front All right so this is better text mm -hmm. All right so we can adjust it okay it has been adjusted Okay, it has been adjusted already <clears throat> the other information is going to be the circle that will contain um, the Gabriel's name so go over there and then click on this on circle all right okay so this circle is going to carry one of the color remember the three color we're going to use is red yellow and blue so there's already the effect already on the background that's the three colors Right, so but let's just go ahead and put this one here and then let's choose a blue color for it right mm -hmm. so this is a blue okay so if you want to be sure we should just go over there use the color picker to pick on it i can see all right pick the blue color all right there's that one okay mm, if we add an outline to it okay So if it's not okay, we're gonna remove it. So let's go over there now. Now we want to put the uh, the cough test. So the, the what will be there? I'm gonna put Shinsong Obona. All right. Now he's gonna be repeating itself again. So come over there again. Copy this. Put it there again. All right. Um, two. Mm, let's see. Two. Okay. Okay let's make it three okay let's make it three so it's gonna be you repeat itself three times right and then we're gonna reduce it and then stretch it reduce and stretch it right so this is it now this is what we're gonna, we're gonna use to form the curve so i want to make it bold all right and then i'm gonna make it a curve now so go to curve and then take it to 100 percent it has formed half circle all right half cycle so come over there and then put it any position there and then use the relative position to centralize it okay after you've done that copy it and then use the rotate to take it to 100 and minus 180 so that you can now place it like this mm? use your hand to place it and then go to relative position and make sure that it is properly positioned and then go over to where we have the the layers and then um uh what's it blend them together mesh them together all right so i've meshed them together now now since i've measured together they are now one entity if you are going to be merging stuff together so please make sure that you are not merging them when part of it is not showing if not it's going to cut out so merge them together and make sure that they are showing very well so this is it so i've merged this guy together all right they are now together so i'll just go over there and then adjust it okay i'll just adjust it okay so this is it okay so next it's gonna be um i think 20 26 right so come over there copy this and then bring it here okay so just take this one out and just put 26 there all right okay all right 
so i'll try to zoom in so that i'll see very well what i'm doing so I'll zoom in like this all right then i'll just adjust this guy here so it's 26th august okay so i would um, copy this again and then i'll put it here if i don't want to do it that way that means i can do it another way all right but let me just do it this way just go over there august okay all right so um, the simple thing to do here is to reduce the font all right then so that it will sit here all right then um, we can go ahead and increase the, the spacing the line spacing mm -mm. all right so this is it so having done this um let's take this guy back so we've done this now so um the next thing we want to do is to bring in some some effect the way the picture is is almost okay i mean i'm talking about based on the background but i'll prefer a gray um scale like this a, okay i prefer a black and white like this let's see all right okay Okay, so the next thing I want to do is to bring in a light effect. Um, it may not be too necessary, but let's see, let's see, let's see. All right, so let me get the logo. Let me get the logo. So this is the logo, all right? And then we'll bring it to the front. All right, which other information is there? Okay, so that is basically what is there. All right, so I want to bring in this red. Um, all right, so it's, it's blue, yellow, and red I'm using. So I can see that blue is, is already playing there. I want to bring in red. Okay, I want to bring in red into the design. So I'll just enable and then red will come. And I'll bring this guy to the front. I'll take this down take this down okay so this is 12 minutes gone already i'll take this down and i'll bring this guy to the front that's all right so okay so this is it uh, i don't think there's any need for that lens that uh, lens flare I don't think there's any need for it because the it's already showing so the next thing we want to do is the name all right so we'll copy this we'll copy this all right all right this is going to be she some right. she some all right okay so it's going to be white in color okay okay so reduce it and put it right there okay Cool. Uh, okay, so we'll get the name. Alright, so we'll get the name here. Yeah. So we'll go over there and then um Gabriel. Ogona. Okay, so that is that is it. Alright, so this is it. So go over there and then let's just zoom it and then finish up with this part. Okay, so just go there and put it right there. Okay, so I'll just make this guy bold. Alright, that's the sun name. I'll just make it bold. Alright, so. So let's bring in this one more time. All right. So what we're going to do with this now? All right. We just want to add just this light effect to the design. Um, I don't think this is even necessary again. I don't think it's necessary so this is just a quick better design for 
Shiso Obona. And I believe all that we needed to do have been done. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. My name remains Ni Yamuda and I'm your friend. I will see you in the next tutorial. Don't forget um, GBD Masterclass. The registration is ongoing. All right, um, that's going to teach you how to create the awesome design with your smartphone and how to sell your design, how to make money. Nine business. I want you to register for that course. The first link in the description of this video, click on it and sign up for that class. More than 60 people are already registered. I'll see you in class.